This is the Guild 1979 D25. Very orchestral sounding guitar. I love a great Martin, but they tend to be a lot darker. This Guild is very orchestral with a lot of great overtones, very sparkling mid range, but very defined bass and treble. This is an incredible sounding instrument. a big performance here just trying to this is an incredible guitar if you're if you were thinking about buying like a martin for two three thousand dollars again i love martins but this kicks their ass right i'm telling you man this this guitar is, is more orchestral i still love martins i've used them on my cd but if you're looking for a great guitar you know in the fifteen two thousand dollar price range check this out i'm you know bring cash i'll give you a killer deal listen to that tone it's incredible These are new strings, so they're probably stretching out. I'll play real soft by the mic so you can... This is just a cheap webcam. Really has a nice voice. Give me a call at 714-548-0385 if you'd like to check it out. I don't pressure anybody to buy my guitars. All I say is listen to me because I will educate you. I know a lot about guitars. I've been playing a long time. You can go to VintageGuitar.com, type in Steve Zook. My original CD comes up. I'm very proud of that. The reviewer of the CD has bought guitars from me, Mr. Stephen Stone. He's a world-class writer, writes for Vintage Guitar, Stereophile, Mix Magazine, uh, Audiophile, Stereo Review. And uh, most of the people's CDs that are reviewed at VintageGuitar.com are, you know, all major, huge people like Eric Clapton, Steve Ray Vaughan. I'm not uh, at that level, but, you know, um, they did appreciate the CD and appreciate me as a composer, so they did a review on, on it. It's sitting there with all those other people. So if you'd like a great guitar, come check this out. Give me a call. Steve, 714-548-0385. I'm over by Warner and Bolsa Chica. And if you bring cash, I'll bend over backwards to work with you because we're not as worried about getting top dollar for our guitars as we are. Just moving them, recouping a little bit of money because most of these projects that we took them in for studio time, these guys were buying 100, 150 hours of studio time. So, so we made our money. So we're, we're moving some inventory because we're running out of room over at the studio. So give me a call, bye-bye.